Hello guys, my name is Peter. I'm from thesupportzone.com and the goal of thesupportzone.com is to provide bookkeeping services to small business owners. Either you are using QuickBooks and Quicken, you can contact me and uh, my expertise are in the two softwares from you can say since 2017 i am helping clients since 2017 remotely so in case you're looking for some kind of a help related to quickbooks or a bookkeeping help you can contact me and the contact information is mentioned into the below description section all right so let's come to this uh, video here as you can see by the title and the thumbnail that this video is all about how we can download an older version of quickbooks desktop so recently what happened one of my existing client called me and told me that the new subscription editions going to be expensive for him so he told me he wants to use the older edition of quickbook so he was kind of a concern was he able to use it or not i told him yes like you can use it but you cannot use it with the online services when i say online services it means he cannot download the banking information into the quickbooks automatically and he was kind of like quickly ready that's not a problem for him so what he did he told me how he can download the older version onto the quickbook so i showed him a way like uh, how you can download it and after so like working with him I quickly wrote a blog about it which I will quickly show you in a quick second that how you can do it uh, like how you can download the older product of QuickBooks. So there are two things that you need in um, before you can download the older product onto your computer. First thing is you need to have a license and the product number ready for your QuickBooks instead after the installation I mean uh, you need to have this information ready. Second thing if you do not have this information ready you can log into your Intuit account and with the help of your Intuit account you will be able to get this information easily so first thing here let me quickly take you to the Intuit account let me help you how you can log into your Intuit account so you can log into camps.intuit.com so by visiting this website you can easily log into your Intuit account you can enter your registered email address and then you can enter your password in to log into your Intuit account afterwards you can like once you will be ready with the license information and the product information for your quickbooks you can quickly come to my website which is the supportzone.com and once you will be on my website you can quickly scroll down the window to the very bottom and under the footer section here it says resources and below to it it says download old quickbook okay you can click on it and you will be able to see this blog which i recently wrote like about how you can download the old quickbooks version and this blog post is completely focused on the US based users let's say you are watching this video outside of the United States let's say you are using QuickBooks Canadian edition or a UK edition this video may not help but you can still watch it to get an idea about it how you can use the older version okay quick and important update or a notification that uh, I also mentioned into this blog here like using an unsupported QuickBooks version may pause a potential security risk to your system we encourage upgrading it to the latest supported version to ensure the smooth and safety selling of your product okay so it means like we also suggest i i personally suggest you to use latest version of quickbook and you cannot like uh, if it is possible for the business to use the latest version please go ahead and do it that will really help the businesses to use okay now that will really help the businesses to wide any kind of like a security risk for the books and all okay so let's come to this uh, blog section here i mean to this blog so when i wrote this blog i mentioned all the edition in this blog here when you scroll the window down a little bit you can see i mentioned all the versions here like quickbooks pro premiere enterprise point of sale which is completely an unsupported product now quickbooks for mac and an accountant edition so for this purpose i'm going to give you an example of quickbooks pro so let's say a user wants to download an older version of quickbooks pro so he can quickly click on this quickbooks pro. and the website uh, like i mean this it will gonna take him down to this section here on this web page i mean on this blog page which says old quickbooks pro versions and i also mentioned the year from which year till which year the editions are available on this blog here you can see from 2005 till 2021 quickbooks pro editions are available to download okay 
So let's say he has 2019 information available which he purchased back in the year of 2019. Let's say he purchased QuickBooks Pro 2019 back in uh, back in 2020 or back in 2019. So what he can do, he can simply download this QuickBook here by clicking on this blue link icon or if I say a button and if you can see here QuickBooks Pro 2019 is started uh, to get uh, to download. So once it will be completed, I will gonna get back to you guys and then we will gonna move forward from there okay all right guys as you can see quickbook pro 2019 is downloaded let's quickly go ahead and click on it to launch the installation file all right in the meantime i just want to let you know that uh, if you're interested for some kind of a bookkeeping related assistance you can call me directly on this number 650-481-6274 otherwise you can like go to the contact us page and you can leave an inquiry and i will get back to you as soon as possible for me right so when you launch the installation it will gonna quickly ask for the user account permission click on yes to launch the installation here then click on next and it will start to install all the necessary files for quickbooks 2019 right and let's quickly click on yes here because it was installed so that's why it was asking us but in your case it may not gonna ask for this option also i just want to mention in the meantime this installation is working like it worked i will quickly click on accept and continue and now you can see here it asks us for the license and the product number as i am handy with this information okay so i will gonna quickly go ahead and put that in so give me one quick moment here let me quickly type that in here all right all right i just entered it and then i click on next okay let me minimize this blog for us for a second here so if you can see here like express we considering that right now uh, like uh, for this video purpose like uh, we are installing it for the one computer let's say you want to install it for the couple of computers and you purchased it for the multi-user licenses then you can go for the second option okay but for this video purpose i'm gonna go with express method here for the installation type and then i click on install here all right in the meantime this installation is going on i would like to show you one thing here uh, like with these all download link okay you can see the last release i also mentioned all the release for these products uh they may not be updated or up to date but as for my knowledge whichever was available for me i quickly put that in for this blog post here okay and one more thing this blog post and intuit account link will be i mean for this uh, in order to log into your intuit account these two links will be gonna mention into my description section below in this video so you can easily come to these website or the web pages and then it will gonna be really easy for you to get back on this okay apart from this let's quickly go ahead and see uh, all right so the installation is still going on which may take some time to complete my request I will like I mean I will get back to you guys once the installation uh, will be completely done all right all right guys as you can see quickbooks has successfully installed so let's quickly go ahead and open quickbook and it may take a while to pull up it should not take uh, this long okay here we go as it is a older product so things may not gonna work accordingly my suggestion as i said before please try to run the new and the latest edition for your safe okay so in order to activate this product click on begin activation it will take a minute or two to activate this product Product. and uh, within a next second it will quickly register the product or it will gonna ask you for come some kind of a okay so you can see the registration is done here and i click on no thanks start quickbooks and you can see quickbooks is ready to go now if you want you can create a new company file if you want or if you have an existing company file which you can run here and if you want you can open a sample company file to see how quickbooks is work so this is how you can download the older version of quickbook onto your computer please aware about the system configurations if that will gonna work with your older version of quickbooks or something like that because i have seen in the past like a lot of clients are still using an older version i have seen very elderly users of quickbooks are using quickbooks 10 even quickbooks 2008 or something like that and they are still using windows 7 or even windows xp so and if they are trying to upgrade to windows like a oh, windows 10 
10 or something like that we, um, like quickbooks may not work which they were using with the windows xp or with windows 7 okay so please ensure about all these kind of safety so this video was all about how you can download quickbook older version so please do subscribe my channel and like this video i will gonna come up with some more tutorial video how things work in quickbooks as well as with the next upcoming days i'm trying to launch uh, quicken tutorials as well so on this channel you will going to get all about quicken and quickbooks things like i'm not gonna say like it will gonna be a complete tutorial like small videos will gonna work or something like that okay so for today this was all about this video i will see you in the next one thank you have a great day